Kai, first of all, welcome to, to Falkirk TV and, and welcome to obviously your, your second uh, second time playing here at the Falkirk Stadium. Yeah, I'm just delighted to also get back fit. It's been a long time and just need to get back fit and hopefully keep getting minutes and just keep getting myself fit. As you mentioned that, obviously, that, that hernia, that, I suppose it's you, you sign one day and then literally the next again day you've got that you've got that injury. Yeah, of course, I was absolutely gutted, but it's football, isn't it? You need to take it, you get the ups and you get the downs. And I think I'm just positive now and I just try to get the foot running and get minutes under my belt. In terms of minutes under the belt, you managed to do that the last last three games, the Fairman game, Partick Thistle game and also the game here uh, against Clyde. And I thought when you came on, the, the, yourself and, and uh, Cal Morrison seemed to complement yourself on either either wing. Yeah, of course we work on it in training and I think as the games go on, I, I know I'm getting sharper and fitter. Of course, it's going to be hard on a comeback for an eight month injury, but... I think as the days go on, I'm working hard on the pitch and off the pitch, and I think I'm getting there and hopefully I'll be, be able to play full games soon. Does it help as well having obviously Juan Allegra, who you've obviously worked with at Rangers as well, being playing, coming on and, and playing at the same time? Does that, that help that you've got that relationship together? Yeah, yeah of course. I've, he's been at a club a couple of years now, and I think me and him get on along well, and I think on the pitch we get on well as well. In terms of you coming on to the park, I mean, you did mention off camera that you, you should, have, should have scored in front of the Kevin McAllister stand. Yeah, I should have. Just, it happens, doesn't it? But hopefully it comes soon. Uh, in terms of the, the, the game itself, I mean, how, did you, how did you feel Falkirk played? I don't think we were at our best today, 100%. I think we got the win, which all matters, was the three points. But I think the last two weeks we've been playing very well. And I think today was just a wee bit scrappy, maybe the weather was a bit bad and stuff. But the only thing is it matters is the win, so... Yeah, I mean, as you said, I mean, we, we don't really get a, a true perspective with it being so windy and on, on pitch side. Was it causing problems? Yeah, of course it comes into impact a wee bit, but I think we still played well and kept the ball well and we had chances. It was just one of the days, but we got the three points, which is all we came for. And it's good as well, obviously, going up the table and, and results have sort of went our, our way as well up to, to fourth in the league. Uh, in, in terms of yourself personally, in terms of, as you mentioned, minutes, game time that, that you're that you're solo looking for, but also as well hoping to get yourself into that first 11. Yeah, that's what I'm here to do. I just need to take my time and when the chance comes that I'm in, then it's my jersey and hopefully I can keep it. And The team have been playing very well and you can't complain when a team's winning and playing very well, but... When I come on, I just need to keep doing what I'm doing, and I thought today I was a lot better than I have been. I just feel like I'm getting sharper and fitter, so I feel good. I mean, even likes of when I mean, you've got somebody experienced as Steve McGinn uh, with you in the midfield, obviously, he, he dictated the play totally today, and obviously, two good goals from him. Yeah, yeah two great goals. First goals I've seen him score, but <laughs> it was two good, two great finishes, and good for him. And I think he's been playing well, and he does control the midfield. Most games I've watched, he's controlled it and dominated it, so if do that full season, then I think we've got a good chance. Go to a venue that's been tricky for us in the past, uh, up to, to Peterhead, they got a draw as well against Dunfermline, last minute equaliser that they managed to get, so it just shows that these games that we think are going to be easier are, are not. Yeah, you can't go into a game thinking it's going to be easy, I think you need to go into every game with the same mindset, however you're playing, if you're playing Dunfermline, Peterhead, you just need to go into that mindset, and of course it's up there, it's going to be a tough game, and it might be a bit different from playing at home, but this is the games that win your league, so I think you need to go up there and take all three points, and I think the boys will be confident to go and do it. Hopefully, fingers crossed we are. Kai, pleasure to speak to you. Thanks for your time. Yes.